Why did Harlan kill the Hargreave siblings' mothers in the Umbrella Academy Season 3? And why were other women from the 43 cut in his massacre? To say the Umbrella Academy's antics in 1963 had unintended consequences would be a Luther-sized understatement. By letting their future father see what a mess his Umbrella Academy became, the Hargreave siblings pushed Sir Reginald to create the Sparrow Academy instead. A whole new team, save Ben, who Reginald never met, in a whole new reality. Surely, this spells complete disaster for the time-space continuum, right? Apparently not. After careful consideration, number 5 decides this altered timeline is pretty much fine, so long as no one bumps into their doppelganger. And therein lies the problem. The original Hargreave siblings have no doppelgangers in the Sparrow timeline. This means their presence is a paradox, and that paradox creates the Kugelblitz that triggers the Umbrella Academy Season 3's apocalypse. As Elliot Page's Victor soon discovers, these doppelgangers are missing because Harlan Cooper killed the Umbrella Mothers, plus a bunch of other women from the original 43 births that happened spontaneously across the world, before the babies were born. Why would sweet, innocent Harlan carry out this maternal massacre, especially those whose children weren't in the Umbrella Academy, and how is such a feat actually possible? The Umbrella Academy's mother deaths are sealed in 1963, when Victor accidentally imbues Harlan with powers while saving the boy's life. Attempts to remove them are unsuccessful, and Harlan spends the next 50 years struggling to contain the white violin's awesome power. As proven by the bunny and bully incidents, emotional situations trip Harlan into losing control, unleashing a destructive vibration similar to Victor's. Because Sir Reginald suppressed Victor's powers for so long, old man Harlan is way more knowledgeable about their gift, and explains they can feel the vibration of other superpowered kids. So, when Sissy passes away on October 1, 1989, the day the 43 children are supposed to be born, the grief stricken Harlan senses Victor. Psychically reaching out, he finds Victor's mother shortly before giving birth instead. His grief combined with her fear triggers Harlan's biggest outburst yet. Completely unintentionally, his vibrations cause brain hemorrhages in Victor's mother and 26 others.